Yangwapo said this in a media statement while reacting to the highest number of daily infections at 1,045 recorded on Thursday. He said the SUN is gravely worried about the uncontrollable spike in COVID-19 cases in the past week and acknowledged the reality that the country has entered the third wave of the pandemic. He noted that the basic education fraternity was one of the affected sectors with the death of a 14-year-old grade 8 learner from the Hagegengov High School in Ventuk. SUN said 17% of positive cases recorded is between the ages of 5 to 19, a clear message that the safety and well-being of learners are at risk with the current mode of face-to-face -face teaching. It is in this light that the SUN is calling for the closure of schools across the country for the whole of June over the concerns of death and the rising of COVID-19 cases, said the statement. Yang Wapo added that they wrote a letter to the Minister of Education, Arts and Culture, Anangi Pondoka, requesting her to suspend face-to-face -face teaching as an urgent action and for schools to utilize online facilities and other home-based teaching facilitations while stakeholders discuss the way forward for teaching to continue without risking the lives of the learners. On Thursday, Iponoka told Nampa that the school's calendar would not be interrupted because it is more risky in terms of social factors when children are at home than at schools.